Well, as you can see, uh, I've printed out another object. Uh, in this case, it is a uh, Great Highland Bagpipe Chanter. Um, I printed it out in three sections because the volume that I'm able to print in uh, was not able to contain the height. The uh, sections uh, were printed upright, so you'll have the, um, the ring structure from each layer going up like this. I did uh, send out each section and then glued them and taped them together with uh, black tape just to provide uh, a airtight seal. Let me show you a little bit closer here. Oh well. The sun's in my eyes, but it won't bother you any. It's a bit flat. Um, the lower notes can uh, break very easily. I think it's a very good first attempt uh, at printing a Great Highland Bagpipe Chapter. I don't know if one has been printed yet. This might be the first, might not be, whatever. Um, I'm hoping at a later date to be able to print a full length one, but I don't have the printer yet to do so. What else can I tell you about it? Um, I did try to print out horizontally the chanter. And in this case, right in here, the print, it was printing out, it printed out like this. So at the top of the dome, which would have been right in here, you had some spaghettiing effect occurring where basically there was nothing holding, there was nothing underneath as the curve went to its peak, there wasn't any layering underneath that would work very well. And so basically I ripped it out and then sanded it. The problem I have with this one is um, it's very thin, which isn't really a problem when you print it this way, but when it's printed in a horizontal fashion, you can, this can happen. I mean, it's very easily twisted in this axis. Of course, if I printed out two of them, slapped them together, glued them, somehow made sure that the seal was good, uh, it'd probably be fine. Again, I wish I had a printer that uh, was able to print out a support. If I could print out a support structure underneath, the kind that can be washed away, uh, it would be a lot nicer to do. I believe uh, the, pro the professional 3D printer company out there can actually print a full chanter. Um, my guess at uh, checking it would probably be about $50 or so uh, based on the volume of the plastic. Uh, what else can I tell you? Um, I think that's about it. Uh, if I print out another one, uh, I will certainly uh, do a video of it as well. But uh, there you go, uh, 3D printed Great Highland Bagpipe Chanter. Bye.